Alright guys, today I've got another fun video here on my brand new uh, HTC One M8 for Verizon and I'm going to show you guys how to turn on power saving mode on your device. Now this is a feature that's not normally enabled, um, so let me just show it to you really quick. We'll actually, we'll go into settings and if you screw down, scroll down here you should see power and you can see you have the battery percentage and some other little information about battery but there's nothing here to turn on power saving mode alright so what we're gonna do is show you how to do that so what you're gonna do is go into the uh, Play Store or App Store or Google Play however you wanna call it and you're gonna download this application right here it's called SQ Light Editor now I think this does cost maybe a couple bucks um, but uh, no, not to worry it's not too much and I've actually used it for other things too um, it can actually do quite a bit of stuff so here you go I, you can see I've already got it downloaded now this is going to require root access so um, if you don't have root access on this device yet definitely uh, go and get root access on it and um, I've got a video on it so I'll probably put that in the video description down below and then you're going to get SQLite Editor. So you're going to open up SQLite Editor and it looks at all of the applications on your device. Um, it is going to ask you for root access. Mine's already done that so it doesn't have a pop-up but it should pop up. Go ahead and grant it root access. Then you're going to scroll way down here to should be called a storage settings if I can find it here. Or settings storage, I'm sorry. So you're going to click on that application right there. And then you're going to see this settings dot db click on it then you're going to click on secure and then we got to find two things to enable in here all right and this is easily reversible if you decide you want to turn it off for some reason um, so what you're going to do is you're going to find this one right here which is hide um, underscore ui underscore user underscore power saver and it says one so what you're going to do is you're going to make sure it's highlighted click the little pencil up here and edit it and then you're going to bring that one and you're going to make it into a zero and hit save. And then a couple below that you should see this line right here which says hide underscore UI underscore power save underscore connectivity. And again you're going to click the edit button, erase the one, put in the zero, hit save. And that should be it. So you can go ahead and just go back to home. And then the easy thing that we're going to do next is just to make sure that applies is you're just going to hold down power, restart the device. So while this is restarting, um, I want to show off my new case because it's pretty cool looking. Uh, this is a cruiser light case I have right here and I really like it. It's, it's got some cool stuff on it. It's got this looking um, circuit board looking thing with the Android on the back. Um, clear but this is like smoked right around all this stuff is. Um, pretty cool. I actually really like that this look. It's a very nice case. Uh, if you guys haven't seen cruiser light cases, these are things are awesome. So hopefully I'm gonna start using this thing as my daily driver now that I have a case for it. Also looking to get a screen protector. I got one on order. I'll probably show you guys that when I get it in. So we're almost booted up here, and I'm gonna be able to show you this power saving mode we just enabled. Now, I think from what I read online, power saving mode is enabled on like the international versions of the HTC One M8 but for some reason it's not on the US versions don't really know why but to get into it we'll go right back to our power saving menu and right here and there you go you can actually see it right there it says power save optimize battery life so we'll turn it off and you can turn it back on and it should be running for you now before I actually had a notification with it on here, which is kind of interesting it's not in there, but you should have a notification along the top saying that it is in power save mode. Um, maybe another restart will get that to show up on there. Uh, but other than that, that's it. You have power save mode enabled. Um, very, very cool. That's how you do it. And now you should have better battery life on this device. So pretty simple. Um, big props to the guy next to you who pointed this out I just followed his thread and I'll link you to that in the video description as well up oh, there it is see right there there it is power saving is on 
that's the notification and you can actually turn it off right here with just a quick click and then if you want to turn it back on just get back into settings and turn it back on and then there you go there's your notification right up top so very very slick definitely like this hopefully my battery life will last even longer than it already does and that's pretty much it how to enable power saving mode on the HTC One M8 Verizon. Hope you guys like this quick video on this device. Stay tuned for more on it as more development happens. Hopefully we'll get an unlocked bootloader soon, S off and all those goodies. Maybe even a fully working root access instead of this temp root we're running with right now. But that's gonna be all for me today and we'll catch you guys next time. Root Junkie out.